Hey everybody, it's Evie here. I just wanted to do a quick video on essential console commands for recording. Um, I've had a lot of people message me inquiring about, you know, what command does this and, you know, how do I remove that and I feel like I should just do a console video so that I can answer everybody's questions and not have to reply to so many messages. So, the commands that I use for recording may differ from what other people's preferences are, but I mean, I'm going to explain them so you can use them at your discretion. So, let's get started. The first one is SV Cheats. You have to enable cheats before you can enter commands. So, the command for that is SV underscore cheats1. Pretty basic. Second thing that I normally do is to hide the plus one multiplier, which is handy, very handy, because I hate it. A lot of people like it. I don't think it's clean, so I normally kick that out. And for that, I do MP game mode co-op. Normally it's set to versus, obviously, if you're playing another team. Co-op makes it so that it gets rid of the plus one multiplier because it thinks you're playing against NPCs. Uh, next command I normally use is to hide the glowing aura around, you know, survivors, any type of item. Um, and the command for that is CL underscore glow underscore brightness zero. Another thing I need to touch base on is a lot of people don't understand why there's numbers after commands. The reason for the numbers is pretty basic. Zero means that you're turning it off or getting rid of it. One means that you're enabling it or, you know, making it evident and useful. So just to clear that up. Another command that I use is hide HUD, which basically takes off everything that is covering your screen that's an overlay aside from the gameplay. So that would be player bars, kill pop-ups, and anything like that. Your ammo and your gun on the side and all that good stuff. So hide HUD 4 will get rid of everything, but if you want to get rid of specific things you can obviously get specific with it. So if you want to make it to where you only have the kill HUD, it is hide HUD space 88. And if you want to do the same but on infected, that's for survivor. Uninfected, it would be HUD underscore zombie team zero. Two very useful commands. Next command I use is really only something I would use if I'm smoothing. And I'm smoothing something that is active. So if I'm on the survivor team or on the infected team. But I mean if it's just a stock demo that I'm sitting in and... Well, I guess I take that back. I would still be a character. Unless you're spectating, then you wouldn't have to use it, but you're normally not spectating many games, unless you're watching a scrim. Anyways, the command for that is r underscore draw view model zero, and basically that hides your model's arms. However, if you are infected, and say you're a hunter and you're pouncing, then your body becomes in third person. It will not hide that. It only hides your arms. So if you're jumping or, you know, smoking somebody or booming, it's going to show that. It does not hide that. I touch base on that in my uh, demo smoothing video because, you know, you have to talk about that. Because when you're smoothing, you're normally survivor or infected. So that is, that is an essential command. So I think that's about it. Um... Another thing that I do, which doesn't necessarily result to a console command, is for my video editing, I know a lot of other people do this as well, to get rid of the blue and orange infected overlays. It's a, a folder that you have to remove, or not a folder, a file per se, and that can be found in your Steam folder under uh, Left 4 Dead, and then Left 4 Dead again, and it's in uh, Materials, and then Correction. And it's the two one two of the files that say infected, and then the two that say ghost. And that'll get rid of the blue hue and the orange hue. So I think that's pretty much it. Um, tried to touch base on all those commands. Sorry for the long video. I wanted to explain them briefly, but 
seems like this is going to take forever. I will put down in the description uh, pen points of durations so that people can see what command I'm talking about and go to it instead of having to watch the whole thing. So hopefully this helps. And uh, if anybody has any more questions, feel free to leave me a comment or send me a message. Bye.